Hey everybody, Jake here with Jake Wu Market Research. To go over um, how can price increase without an increase in buyers? And the question is really answered simply through the supply and demand curves here. So what you can see here is we have D1 and S1, which is the original equilibrium price. Now, a lot of the time we talk about the volume shelf and as price gets back down to that volume shelf from the price being above it, supply dries up and price is able to move up. And we talk about that we don't necessarily need buyers to step in for that price to move up. Why is that? Well, from an economic standpoint, you can see here from the uh, S1 to S2 shift in the supply curve to the left here, you can essentially see as quantity supplied decreases, you can see that this uh, curve is uh, essentially shifting up the demand curve while demand is remaining constant. So you have your price equilibrium here initially um, at QS1, which is quantity supplied originally. And as the supply curve shifts to the left, you can see the quantity supplied shifts to the left. And that actually moves the price up by simply just shifting that curve up the demand curve. So you can see here how this works without any increase in buyers. Remember, if demand is remaining constant, all supply needs to do is dry up for that equilibrium price to move up. So this hopefully answers the question, how can price move up without an increase in buyers? And it's simply just based on the supply and demand curve and uh, economic forces at work. Hopefully this video helps. Everybody have a great evening and thanks for watching.